Welcome to the West Chicago Public Library District's eBook tutorial. On this clip, I will be explaining how to download eBooks directly to a Mac computer and then to a Nook Simple Touch device. A Nook Simple Touch device does not have web browser capabilities or app capabilities. If you have a Nook with those options, view our other eBook tutorial videos. For this tutorial, you will need a computer, your Nook Simple Touch, and your West Chicago library card. The first thing that we're going to do is go to the West Chicago Public Library District website. The address is www.westchicago.lib.il.us. On the main page, scroll down to the bottom corner where it says My Media Mall and click on it. After clicking on the My Media Mall tab, you will be brought to the My Media Mall website. Before we get a book, we need to download Adobe Digital Editions onto our computer. Click on the Help tab in the top right-hand corner of the screen so that we can start to download Adobe Digital Editions onto the computer. After clicking on the Help tab, you will be brought to this page. Scroll all the way down to where it says Software. We're going to click on this link that will bring us to the Adobe Digital Editions download page. After clicking on the software icon, we will be brought to this page. Click on the Adobe Digital Editions icon. This is what we need to download onto our computer. After clicking on the Adobe Digital Editions icon, we will be brought to the Adobe Digital Editions page. In the top right-hand corner, you will see the tab Download Now. Click on it. On the next page, you will have the option to choose which type of computer you want to download Adobe Digital Editions to. Since this tutorial is covering Mac computers, click on the tab that says Macintosh. After clicking Download to Macintosh, you will eventually see this screen. To get to the screen, you may need to double click on your Downloads tab. Once the screen appears, double click on the icon. After double clicking on the icon, you will be prompted to press continue and follow the steps to download Adobe Digital Editions onto your computer. During the downloading process, you will be asked to agree to install Adobe Digital Editions to your computer. Click agree. You will then be asked to install Adobe Digital Editions to your computer. If you do want to do this, click install. Once Adobe Digital Editions has downloaded onto your computer, you will receive this message saying that the installation was successful. Now that we have downloaded Adobe Digital Editions to our computer, we can go back to the My Media Mall website found at the West Chicago Public Library District website. From here we will be able to download a book. Go to the top right hand corner and click Sign In. You will be asked to select a library, as well as to entering your library card number and PIN number. The library card number is the really long number underneath the barcode on the back of your library card. The PIN number is either your own secret password, or if you haven't changed it, it is simply change me, all lowercase with no spaces. Once you are signed into the My Media Mall website, this is what the screen will look like. You can select a book by searching for its genre or by searching in the search engine box in the top right hand corner. For the purpose of this tutorial, click on a genre. The next screen will show you all the books that are available in the genre that you selected. On the left hand side, you can limit books based on format, language, reviews, and other options. It is important to note that for reading books on a Nook, you can only select ePDF or ePub books. Let's choose the ePDF limit on the left-hand column so that the books that are shown are only in this specific format. Once we have limited our options, this is what the next screen will look like. At the top of the page, there's a selection for Available Now so that you can only see titles that are currently available for checkout. You can also tell if a book is available for checkout by the dark box in the corner of the title. 
Once you see a title you like, click on it. Once you have selected a title, this is what it will look like on the checkout page. You can see on the right hand side what type of formats the book is available in as well as how many copies are available. Click on the tab that says Borrow. Once you click on the tab Borrow, the tab will change to Go to Bookshelf. Click on the tab Go to Bookshelf. On the next screen, you will see your bookshelf. You can check out a total of five ebooks. If you change your mind about this title, you can simply click Return before you check it out. You can also click on the Settings tab on the right hand corner to alter your checkout period. This is the settings page. You can check out ebooks for either one week or two weeks. Once you have altered your checkout periods, you can click back on bookshelf on the right hand side. Once we are back on our bookshelf page, click on the tab that says read in browser right next to the book. You will then be asked to click Confirm, stating that once you select this format, you cannot download this title in any other format. After clicking Confirm, your book will automatically download to Adobe Digital Editions. From here, you can read the book directly on your Mac computer. If you wish to download it to a Nook Simple Touch, click on Library in the top left-hand corner. This screen will show you what your Adobe Digital Editions library looks like. To transfer your recently downloaded title, you will need to plug in your Nook Simple Touch with your USB cable into your computer. Once it is plugged in, you will see that it says Nook on the left hand column. To get the book from your computer to your device, Simply click on the title you want and drag it over to the device on the left-hand side. Let it hover over the device and drop it onto the nook. 